We're here with the uh, new Senators forward, Garrett Pilon, uh, who joins the club after winning a Calder Cup with the Hershey Bears last season. Um, welcome to Belleville. Congrats on uh, that achievement, first of all. Yeah, no, thank you very much. I, I'm glad to be here, that's for sure. Yeah, uh, let's talk a little bit about uh, the process. Uh, you spent your entire career in the, the Capitals organization uh, between Washington and Hershey. Obviously, culminates with that Calder Cup last season, and now here you are in a brand new town. Um, what was the process like to, to getting to Belleville, and, and why did this seem like a good fit for you? Uh, you know, it was, it's definitely uh, was a team, I guess, that was, was interested in me, which is the first thing when you go into free agency. You kind of need teams like the, uh, that want you kind of thing. And, um, you know, I, I think as a, as a group, they were, they were looking to build down here in Belleville as well. And that's something that, you know, I want to do again is win. So it, it seemed like a good option for myself and just my career going forward. But, uh, yeah, I've been loving it so far. The guys have been great. Yeah, what have the uh, first impressions been like uh, of the facility, uh, the town? I know you haven't been here long. It's a little bit different than uh, than what you've been used to in Hershey. Yeah, you know, the facility is great here. Guys have been really good. I mean, the town, I'm from Saskatchewan. It's it's very similar, like small town sort of vibes. And, uh, you know, you know, so I'm enjoying it and looking to find kind of some spots here to some restaurants and all that and, you know, get a little settled. Yeah, there'll be uh, plenty of those for you to find for sure. Um, uh, how have the first couple days of camp been? Um, what's it been like, I guess, trying to adjust to new systems, new coaches, new teammates? Yeah, you know, it is. It's the first for me obviously entering a new organization new like philosophies in a certain aspect so it, it is a bit of an adjustment but just looking to kind of soak things up talk things through you know really start to learn um you know the ins and out of the systems before the season here starts and um you know the first couple of days is just kind of getting some of the, the rust and the kinks out from the summer because there's there's usually quite a bit so it, <laughs> yeah. it's, it's getting better though which is good yeah uh, what else did you get up to in the in the summertime how do you like to spend your free time when you're away from the rink uh, it was a short one this year that's for sure i got home i think mid-july which is crazy uh but no just i visited some family obviously and then uh just moved into my place so it was it was it was pretty short but obviously uh, you know i like to go out golf do that hang out with friends go to the lake got a little bit of that in but not too much so yeah right back into hockey Chatting with Suns forward Garrett Pilon, um, you're a veteran player, uh, 250 plus games in the American Hockey League. Um, how would you describe your playing style, and maybe how has it kind of developed over over your career, if at all? Yeah, it's it's weird getting up there for games and all that. You know, it doesn't doesn't seem like uh, seems like yesterday. I guess that I was 20 year old entering the league, so it is an adjustment. You start to learn a few things, and um, you know, adjusting the play style is. I'm just trying to be a full 200 foot player, and uh, you know, those are the I think the types of guys too that can help. Um, you know, win hockey games because there's there's guys that have obviously, obviously high skill and they can put the puck in the net, but you do need the guys that can play at both ends of the rink and you know help contribute where they can. So I'm hoping to just kind of be that versatile player for for the Sens here and you know do whatever is asked of me. And bring obviously some veteran leadership to uh, what's a, a pretty um, talented, I'd say, pool of prospects still in the organization as well. Yeah, you know, looking at the roster and stuff, I mean, there, we are there. There is quite a bit of youth in this organization, which is really good because there's a lot of high skill, um, you know good hockey players, good people as well. So I think that's something that was exciting for me coming into this organization because once you win once, you, you really want to do it again. So that's obviously the, the hope coming into this season. And speaking of winning that championship, uh, you'll get to be back in Hershey for the banner raising on uh, their opening night with, with uh, the Sens. How much are you looking forward to, to going back there? Yeah, you know, I spent obviously five years there and grew up a lot there and, you know, fell in love with the town and all that. So I have, I have nothing but fond memories of Hershey. And it's going to be definitely weird lining up on the other blue line for me. I mean, obviously, there's a lot of players that have been through that in their careers, but it'll, it'll definitely be a first for me kind of playing against guys that I was battling it out with uh, in, at the end of June there. So it'll definitely be weird, but we're going to have to set the tone somehow at the, at the start there. So, yeah, I'm looking forward to it being back there. Well, we're happy to have you here. Uh, yeah. Thanks again for the time, and welcome to Belleville. Yeah, awesome. Thank you very much.